welcome to Medical Dialogues Journal Club, your daily dose of health and medical news. I am Dr. Nandita Mohan and I am going to discuss about the Empulse trial which aimed to find out whether starting a, to take a new medicine called empagliflozin soon after being treated in the hospital helps people recover with acute heart failure. Empagliflozin belongs to a class of medicines known as the SGLT2 inhibitors. It is used to treat most commonly type 2 diabetes. The benefits of the SGLT2 inhibitors for patients with chronic heart failure have been well established in larger randomized trials previously. But many heart failure specialists, most notably the leading clinical trialists, have advocated for SGLT2 inhibitors to be started in the hospital as soon as the patients are stable. Among clinicians more widely, however, there is very reluctance in starting a chronic heart failure drug in a more acute heart failure setting. The Impulse investigators randomized approximately 530 patients into two groups. One group took the one uh, empagliflozin tablet a day, the other group took one placebo tablet a day. The administration was done as soon as the patients were stabilized in the hospital, then followed them up for 90 days for the primary composite endpoint of time of death, frequency of heart failure events or even the time to first heart failure event. The trial results were presented at the AHA conference which stated that the benefits of empagliflozin in this very acute sitting setting included better survival, fewer hospitalizations and greater improvements in the quality of life. The patients that were treated with this particular drug were 36% more likely to experience a clinical benefit in the first 90 days. Patients experienced improvements regardless of the type of heart failure or whether they had diabetes or not. And importantly, in these patients, there was no safety concerns with the use of empagliflozin. The drug has now demonstrated efficacy really across a continuum of ejection fraction in the stable ambulatory outpatient population and now in those admitted with acute heart failure. These trial results will impact the practice of clinicians worldwide and that's because acute heart failure is the number one cause of hospitalization in individuals over the age of 65 in many regions of the world. This is a widely available drug, so Impulse has massive implications in terms of use. We have today with us Dr. Prem Agarwal, a senior cardiologist at Sanjeevan Hospital. Sir, if you could share your thoughts on how empagliflozin can help in acute heart failure, will provide us with insights. Thank you, Nita. With this Impulse trial, we are reaching to uh, new developments in the medical science and this Impulse will stopping to keep surprising us with new results. Uh, after having uh, used it in preserved ejection fraction, now the Impulse trial is showing good results, even acute heart failure. In fact, uh, the hypothesis was used that uh, since we are using it in the reduced ejection fraction, then using it in an early hospitalization stage, that uh, when the patient is uh, with the heart failure is admitted in the hospital in acute heart failure stage, at that time, we will start uh, uh, empagliflozin early, then whether it will be useful or not. And this particular thing has been tested in an uh, um, uh, impulse trial. And uh, it has been found out that the benefit of empagliflozin has been found in even acute settings also, including better survival, better and greater improvement, quality of life. And all this makes the primary endpoints everywhere. It has been found improvement in uh, by giving empagliflozin early. And uh, this uh, inhibitor, uh, this uh, while well, the benefits of this uh, SGL2 inhibitors have been found to be uh, very useful in chronic heart failure. But first time as a leading uh, uh, trial and uh, landmark trial, it has been used in an um, impulse trial where they have used it in acute heart failure. I think that um, this uh, trial will have a long term impact on the clinical uh, uses of uh, empagliflozin uh, that. Um, when we are trying to use it for reducing heart failure, giving better clinical benefits, better quality of life, reduce hospitalization, it will be if it is started early. An impulse um, trial has a, a unique that it is uh, one third of the patients who uh, always come to us um, uh, um, has been randomized with the new onset uh, acute heart failure. And these uh, new onset heart failure, and if we start empagliflozin, it finds benefit. So. I think that is a good uh, development and um, this glow um, a good medicines which are used in different situations 
and they have to be uni uniformly found to be useful. Thank you. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.